Thank you, Abraham. I wanted to first say, uh, sorry, <laughs> it seems like I'm going to swallow it. Um, first say, I'm so grateful. Thank you for being amongst us and for sh- doing what you do. Yeah. Um, trying to get my heart to <laughs> slow down. Um, How do you do that? I don't. I'm, but wait, but, but think about it. So, so when you're aware that you're, that you're agitated or nervous about something, and you say, so you took a deep breath. In other words, you knew, you, you wanted to make an effort to sort of settle down. Isn't that the same thing that we're talking about? About, uh, and so what's the best way, what's the best way to do that? Get into a general place. Mm-hmm. Get into a general place. This is going to be fun. Um, I'm going to express what I want. And eventually it will, it will come clear. Abraham can read my energy and so we'll figure this out. Couldn't be in a better place to have an experience like that, even though I, on the hot seat, it's only friendly in this room. I just feel the excitement and I feel that, um, I, okay. I have many questions, but I have, I know that I won't be able to have them all answered and, and yes, of course, I don't even know what question I would like to ask first, but what I'm, guess I'm, but you see, when you think about an experience like this, now let's put it in the context of everything that we've been talking about. So we've been visiting and everyone in the room, your vibration is in a different place than it was when we started. And, and depending upon the conversation, in other words, we were high flying. The last conversation caused a sort of dip in, in the energy. But you can, you can tell, you, even in a, even in a gathering like this, you can tell which subjects feel like this and which subjects feel like this. There was, we're sort of moving around. But, but your general or average vibration is higher now than it was when you walked in the room. So I'm in the best place of hearing that I've been in a while. So now think about this vortex that we've been talking about where all your questions are. In other words, you've all of the answers to all of those questions and all of the solutions to every situation is there. So the likelihood of something flowing from your vortex into your grid is higher in this moment than it has ever been. That's a really good thing to acknowledge. Isn't it? Yes. So when you take a minute to acknowledge that, not just in a situation like this, but in any situation, my work is to put myself in a situation where what I want can flow in. Isn't that, isn't that what we're talking about all the time? So, and wouldn't it be an exhilarating experience since I'm in this high flying, higher flying, better feeling vibration, wouldn't it be nice to have a dialogue with Abraham where not only does Abraham's brilliant answers flow into my grid, but the, the things that occur to me to ask do so that I'm meeting Abraham on this, on this higher plane higher plane and having a conversation that is more satisfying. Mm-hmm. Don't you like the sound of that? Yeah. It happens all the time, yeah. just like this. Yeah. Well, I've been listening to you for a while, and um, again, I'm... I, Which I, has I, nothing to do with anything, because yes. here we are now. Yes, yes. Here we are yes. right now. Well, what I'm wanting to say is, I, I'm okay, I feel such gratitude, yeah. and um, that is what I use the most often to get into the vortex during the day, I'll just say how grateful. I'll speak to Abraham and say how grateful I am, and to Jerry. Um, but uh, and my, que- I guess my first question would be, what takes me off guard? And I believe that I am in the vortex quite often, simply because of my intense desire. And I not d- enough. Intense desire is not enough. Well, intense I, desire is not enough to be in the vortex. Okay, but I do appreciate. So let, but let's I say am. other. Let's put other words to it. Okay, it's my appreciation. Mm-hmm. My appreciation is 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 the key. We're, we're just wanting to turn you because we can yeah. feel we we can feel a powerful, palpable desire within you that you are not letting flow. And part of it is because of this environment, because you're. But but and that's why we are directing you toward this grid and the ease that you're wanting to feel with it and that's why we're sort of nitpicking about the words that you're speaking because you found a word like gratitude we prefer the word appreciation so as you're you are feeling appreciation uh, jerry said he told esther this story many 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 times he said i used to meet people who were in many cases wealthy he was an entertainer for a number of years and so he he met a lot of people and they were wealthy and miserable, he would say. 
And he would say to them, just help someone, just volunteer for something. Find someone other than yourself to focus upon and offer something of yourself to them. And Esther was thinking about that the other day, that that was sort of a trick that he learned for himself, that if he would just put his attention upon some way that he could be helpful, and that's that gratitude that you're talking about, that's that feeling of, of appreciation that you're talking about. So we just want to help you tune to the feeling of that. Talk less and just feel more about that. So, yeah? Well, um, I I think... What I would like to have um, guidance with is that feeling part. And I know it's very obvious. It's the answer to all of the questions. Feel more is always the answer. So take a subject of something that you're wanting to soothe. What's the subject that's, that's causing you the discord? Well, I, I know that... In order to experience what we really it's want. Okay, just answer the question. It, it, what's the subject? What's it's the, the relationship su- with my own vortex, my own All inner right, being. All right, so, so I, I want more personal, um, um, obvious uh, interaction with my inner being. So get as general as you can about that. I want that because it would feel good. Mm -hmm. Because when I experience it, I have greater clarity. Because I know it's the natural thing. Because, give us some words, because... Because it's fun. Because it feels good. And because um, it's just where... I want to be where all everyone wants to be. It's the answer to everything. So go back to the because it's fun. Mm-hmm. Because when you said because it's fun, you brightened up and your energy actually met that energy for just a moment. Mm-hmm. And then you step back from that as you said because it's where we all should be. Want or because to be. it's or or because it's the answer to everything. But you see, you can't you don't want the answers to everything. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All you want to do is just feel it in the now. Mm-hmm. And this is the thing that what you're helping it, this conversation is very helpful to everyone because this is right where we're at with this conversation about the grid because almost everyone you're so patient with us in that you'll come to a gathering like this and you will endure us drawing circles in the air you will in you will endure us explaining to you that you were source energy before you came into this body and that you still are and you will endure our demonstration of how you know what you don't want and you send out these rockets of desires about what you do want and you will even listen to us talking about creating this vortex and now you're listening to us talking about finding a way of allowing this grid to fill in and what we really the reason that we offer all of these things but 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 the thing that's interesting to us as you listen to us offering all of this um, analogy in order to help you to understand the basic laws of the universe. Almost everyone has an ulterior motive that you come with. I'm willing, I'm willing to accept that and 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 that. I'm willing to accept all of that if I can just get this thing that I want. If it'll bring me the lover, if it will bring me the money, if it will, I'm willing to do all this crazy stuff if it will get me the end result that I want. And we want you to understand that the end result that you want is the way you feel when you're standing in a grid with no resistance. That's what you want. Now it'll bring all the stuff and all the love and it'll bring all the other, all the other stuff. It'll, everything, everything that you've ever wanted will come with that. But everything that you want, no matter what it is, a material object, a relationship, a state of being, a pile of money, everything that you want is because you will feel better in the having of it. And we want to give you the tools to feel better in the not having of it because that's how the having of it comes. But it's not the having of it that is the reason that we're wanting to teach you how to have the having of it. We want to teach you how to have the having of it because feeling like that is the way you're supposed to feel, you see. And that's what you're reaching for. Yeah. You said it as well as anyone that we've ever heard. That's what you're reaching for. So, but in order to get there, it requires 
not working so hard on the other because you can't have an active question and have an active answer at the mm-hmm. same time. They, they, it doesn't jive. I, if you, if you've got a question pulsing within you, the answer's not going to come until you take a rest from it. If you've got a problem pulsing within you, the solution can't come. Esther said to her friend, he's become her friend. They're starting to have lunch together. Alec, he comes to fix the stuff in the house. <laughs> and she'll, she says to him the other day, you're fighting a losing battle. And he said, the, the equipment, and she said, no, me. <laughs> me. The equipment has trained me not to believe, and there's nothing you can do that's going to make it work. He doesn't have any idea what she's talking about. He just looks at her and goes back to his work because he thinks he can fix it. He can't. He thinks he can fix it. He can't, he can't hold it in, he can't hold it in place until Esther moves out. <laughs> We're exaggerating a little bit, but how you feel is everything. How you feel is everything. And that's what you just said to us, how you feel. So we want to get, for the most part, we would like to distract you from your problem while you're looking for the solution. And that's why we tell you that it's a three-step process. Step one, the asking, the begging, the pleading, is a whole other first step. We'll, we'll, a new three-step process. Step one, plead, beg. <laughs> ask and life causes you to do that step two is the answer is provided when you ask the answer is provided but step three is you got to prepare the vibration so that the answer can come and there is nothing more 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 your society trains you to your disadvantage but now you know what to do yeah oh yeah um i actually oftentimes get to a point where I laugh at the what is because the contrast is very strong but I'm I know it's a game and I know it's all I well, just get up dust yourself off it, distract yourself in mm-hmm. whatever way you can mm-hmm. take a walk get something to drink mm-hmm. um, uh, do something that to mm-hmm. break the cycle mm-hmm. or the train of thought that you've got going on I just have... do something and in time who you really are will dominate your mm-hmm. experience. I have been doing that, and I've actually... Um, t- You've been doing some of that, but here's the thing. Mm-hmm. Hey, here's the thing that we really, 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 really want you to hear. Mm-hmm. We're not here trying to expose you to some different grid than you want, because you're an example for everyone to, to, to uh, experience, because everyone's doing some of the same thing. You've got to do something different than you're doing if you want to feel different. And so what it happens a lot with students of Abraham is that you've listened to the things you're, you're deliberately applying, but it's not clicking into place quite yet. The feeling of it has not, has not really taken hold. And every single time we want to say, you're trying too hard. You're just trying too hard. You're just trying too hard. You don't have to explain anything. You don't have to manifest anything this red hot minute. There isn't any, there are no requirements. There, there, there's no one giving you any grades. It's just the way you feel and the manifestations that follow. That's everything. So if we are standing in your physical shoes, we would be expecting shifts in many areas dramatic shifts but not dramatic in the sense that they it happens overnight dramatic in the sense that it's it it culminates in something big but gradual 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 in the sense that it's just feeling a little better and feeling a little better and feeling a little better there isn't anything that you're supposed to do and there certainly isn't anything that you're doing wrong and we are appreciating a conversation like this because a lot of people feel like this esther has felt like that a good bit I in the last year that from, Be- because yeah. Because when there's something in your life that is the antithesis of something that you think that you want, it it is annoying at least and incredibly outrageously awful at most to have someone say to you, you should be feeling different than you are. It irritates Ed Esther enormously when people would say, it's all right for you to feel bad. She wanted to throw them somewhere and say, well, I'm glad it's all right for you if I feel bad because it's like I don't have any choice in how I'm feeling. But eventually you have a choice. Eventually you begin, eventually you get hold of your vibration and eventually you begin to be able to make those choices again, you see. We've enjoyed this interaction immensely. We're three minutes into the Twilight Zone. Good time. (laughs) Good time for a segment.